But the point about foreign policy is not just to know that you can overthrow a terrible dictator. It's to understand what happens the day after. And in Libya, for example, the United States, Secretary Clinton, as Secretary of State, working with some other countries, did get rid of a terrible dictator named Gaddafi. But what happened is a political vacuum developed. ISIS came in and now occupies significant territory in Libya and is now prepared, unless we stop them, to have a terrorist foothold. But this is nothing new. This has gone on 50 or 60 years, where the United States has been involved in overthrowing governments. Mossadegh, back in 1953, nobody knows who Mossadegh was, democratically elected prime minister of Iran. He was overthrown by British and American interest because he threatened oil interest of the British. And as a result of that, the Shah of Iran came in, terrible dictator. As a result of that, you had the Iranian revolution coming in, and that's where we are today. Unintended consequences.